C I E T N C E R T presents audio book of mathematics for class 6 chapter 11 algebra page 238 part 4 11.10 solution of an equation we saw in the earlier section that the equation 2n is equal to 10. Equation 1 was satisfied by n is equal to 5. Page 239. No other value of n satisfies the equation. The value of the variable in an equation which satisfies the equation is called a solution to the equation. Thus, n is equal to 5 is a solution to the equation 2n is equal to 10. Note, n is equal to 6 is not a solution to the equation 2n is equal to 10 because for n equal to 6, 2n is equal to 2 multiplied by 6 equal to 12 and not 10. Also, n is equal to 4 is not a solution. Tell why not. Let us take the equation x minus 3 equal to 11. Equation 2. This equation is satisfied by x is equal to 14. Because for x equal to 14, LHS of the equation is equal to 14 minus 3 is equal to 11, which is equal to RHS. It is not satisfied by x equal to 16, because for x equal to 16, LHS of the equation is equal to 16 minus 3 is equal to 13, which is not equal to RHS. Thus, x is equal to 14 is a solution to the equation x minus 3 is equal to 11 and x is equal to 16 is not a solution to the equation. Also, x is equal to 12 is not a solution to the equation. Explain why not. Now, complete the entries in the following table and explain why your answer is yes or no. In finding the solution to the equation 2n is equal to 10, we prepared a table for various values of n, and from the table, we picked up the value of n, which was the solution to the equation, that is, which satisfies the equation. What we used is a trial and error method. It is not a direct and practical way of finding a solution. Here is the table. It has three columns, equation, value of the variable, solution, yes or no. 1. x plus 10 is equal to 30 x is equal to 10? No. 2. x plus 10 is equal to 30. x is equal to 30? No. 3. x plus 10 is equal to 30. x is equal to 20? Yes. 4. p minus 3 is equal to 7. p is equal to 5. No. 5. P minus 3 is equal to 7. P is equal to 15. Dash. 6. P minus 3 is equal to 7. P is equal to 10. Dash. 7. 3N is equal to 21. N is equal to 9. Dash. 8. 3n is equal to 21, n is equal to 7, dash, 9, t upon 5 is equal to 4, 
t is equal to 25 dash 10 t upon 5 is equal to 4 t is equal to 20 dash 11 2l plus 3 is equal to 7 l is equal to 5 dash 12 2L plus 3 is equal to 7. L is equal to 1. Dash. 13. 2L plus 3 is equal to 7. L is equal to 2. Dash. Page 240. We need a direct way of solving an equation. That is, finding the solution of the equation. We shall learn a more systematic method of solving equations only next year. Beginning of Algebra It is said that Algebra as a branch of mathematics began about 1550 BC, that is, more than 3500 years ago, when people in Egypt started using symbols to denote unknown numbers. Around 300 BC, use of letters to denote unknowns and forming expressions from them was quite common in India. Many great Indian mathematicians, Aryabhat, born 476 AD, Brahmagupta, born 598 AD, Mahavira, who lived around 850 AD, and Bhaskar II, born 1114 AD, and others contributed a lot to the study of algebra. They gave names such as Bij, Varna, etc., to unknowns and used first letters of color names. For example, Ka from Kala, that is black, Ni from Nila, which is blue, to denote them. The Indian name for algebra, Bij Garit, dates back to these ancient Indian mathematicians. The word algebra is derived from the title of the book, Al Jabar Wal Al Mugabalah written about 825 AD by an Arab mathematician Muhammad ibn al-Khwarizmi of Baghdad. Exercise 11.5 1. State which of the following are equations with a variable. Give reason for your answer. Identify the variable from the equations with a variable. A. 17 is equal to x plus 7. B. t minus 7 is greater than 5. C. 4 upon 2 is equal to 2. D. 7 multiplied by 3 minus 19 is equal to 8. E. 5 multiplied by 4 minus 8 is equal to 2x. F. X minus 2 is equal to 0. G. 2m is less than 30. H. 2n plus 1 is equal to 11. I. 7 is equal to, in brackets, 11 multiplied by 5 minus, in brackets, 12 multiplied by 4. J. 7 is equal to, in brackets, 11 multiplied by 2, plus P. K. 20 is equal to 5Y. L. 3Q upon 2 is less than 5. M. Z plus 12 is greater than 24. N. 20 minus, in brackets, 10 minus 5 
is equal to 3 multiplied by 5. O. 7 minus x is equal to 5. Page 241. 2. Complete the entries in the third column of the table. We have a table with four columns. Serial number, equation, value of variable. Equation satisfied, yes or no. A. 10y is equal to 80. y is equal to 10. Dash. B. 10y is equal to 80. Y is equal to 8. Dash. C. 10y is equal to 80. Y is equal to 5. Dash. D. 4L is equal to 20. L is equal to 20. Dash. E. 4L is equal to 20. L is equal to 80. Dash. F. 4L is equal to 20. L is equal to 5. Dash. G. B plus 5 is equal to 9. B is equal to 5. Dash. H. B plus 5 is equal to 9. B is equal to 9. Dash. I. B plus 5 is equal to 9. B is equal to 4. Dash. J. H minus 8 is equal to 5. H is equal to 13. Dash. K. H minus 8 is equal to 5. H is equal to 8. Dash. L. H minus 8 is equal to 5. H is equal to 0. Dash. M. P plus 3 is equal to 1. P is equal to 3. Dash. N. P plus 3 is equal to 1. P is equal to 1. Dash. O. P plus 3 is equal to 1. P is equal to 0. Dash. P. P plus 3 is equal to 1. P is equal to minus 1. Dash. Q. P plus 3 is equal to 1. P is equal to minus 2. Dash. 3. Pick out the solution from the values given in the bracket next to each equation. Show that the other values do not satisfy the equation. A. 5m is equal to 60. 10, 5, 12, 15. B. n plus 12 is equal to 20. 12, 8, 20, 0. C. B minus 5 is equal to 5. 0, 10, 5, minus 5. D. Q upon 2 is equal to 7. 7, 2, 10, 14. E. R minus 4 is equal to 0. 4, minus 4, 8, 0. F. X plus 4 is equal to 2. Minus 2, 0, 2, 4. 4. A. Complete the table and by inspection of the table, find the solution to the equation m plus 10 is equal to 16. m, m plus 10. 1, dash, 2, dash, 3, dash, 4, dash, 5, dash, 6, dash, 7, dash, 8, dash, 9, dash, 10, dash, 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 
b complete the table and by inspection of the table find the solution to the equation 5t is equal to 35 t 5t 3 dash 4 dash 5 dash 6 dash 7 dash 8 dash 9 dash 10 dash 11 dash 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 page 242 c complete the table and find the solution of the equation z upon 3 is equal to 4 using the table z z upon 3 8 2 2 upon 3 9 3 10 3 1 upon 3 11 dash 12 dash 13 dash 14 dash 15 dash 16 dash 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 d complete the table and find the solution to the equation m minus 7 is equal to 3 m m minus 7 5 dash 6 dash 7 dash 8 dash 9 dash 10 dash 11 dash 12 dash 13 dash 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 5 solve the following riddles you may yourself construct such riddles who am i 1 go round a square counting every corner thrice and no more add the count to me to get exactly 34 2 for each day of the week make an up count from me if you make no mistake you will get 23 3 i am a special number take away from me a 6 a whole cricket team you will still be able to fix 4 tell me who i am i shall give a pretty clue you will get me back if you take me out of 22 what have we discussed 1 we looked at patterns of making letters and other shapes using matchsticks we learned how to write the general relation between the number of matchsticks required for repeating a given shape the number of times a given shape is repeated varies it takes on values 1 2 3 etc it is a variable denoted by some letter like n page 243 2 a variable takes on different values its value is not fixed the length of a square can have any value it is a variable but the number of angles of a triangle has a fixed value 3 it is not a variable 3 we may use any letter n l m p x y z etc to show a variable 4 a variable allows us to express relations 
in any practical situation. 5. Variables are numbers, although their value is not fixed. We can do the operations of addition, subtraction, multiplication and division on them, just as in the case of fixed numbers. Using different operations, we can form expressions with variables like x minus 3, x plus 3, 2n, 5m, p upon 3, 2y plus 3, 3l minus 5, etc. 6. Variables allow us to express many common rules in both geometry and arithmetic in a general way. For example, the rule that the sum of two numbers remains the same if the order in which the numbers are taken is reversed can be expressed as A plus B is equal to B plus A. Here, the variables A and B stand for any number 1, 32, 1000, minus 7, minus 20, etc. 7. An equation is a condition on a variable. It is expressed by saying that an expression with a variable is equal to a fixed number. For example, x minus 3 is equal to 10. 8. An equation has two sides, LHS and RHS. Between them is the equal sign. 9. The LHS of an equation is equal to its RHS only for a definite value of the variable in the equation. We say that this definite value of the variable satisfies the equation. This value itself is called the solution of the equation. 10. For getting the solution of an equation, one method is the trial and error method. In this method, we give some value to the variable and check whether it satisfies the equation. We go on giving this way different values to the variable until we find the right value which satisfies the equation. You were just listening to the audiobook Mathematics for Class 6 Narrator Gaurav Marva Assistance in Production Soumya Malik Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary Presented by CIET NCERT New Delhi, India